Hey, and welcome back to a brand new video. I thought today's video was actually gonna have some better audio, but I just wasted an entire day, I guess, and now I have to go return this thing tomorrow. So I went to Best Buy today and asked if they had a wireless microphone or recorder, something around those lines, and they said, no, we don't have that. So I was sent to Guitar Center because they would probably have a microphone there. So I went over to Guitar Center, found one of these things and asked them, hey, do you guys have SD cards for this? Because obviously you have to put an SD card in this. They said, no, sorry, you'd probably have to go back to Best Buy for that. And I said, okay, fine. So I bought this thing here at, at, at Guitar Center. So, so then I was sent back to Best Buy. I go back to Best Buy and guess what I find? The same handy recorder that I was looking for, this exact one. It was there, but it was $50 cheaper. I was sent to Guitar Center for no reason. So then I asked for an SD card for this. So they give me an SD card. Uh, come home, I found out, oh, the SD card that they sold me for this, it doesn't work for this because this takes a maximum of 32 gig SD cards and I bought a 64 gig and 128 gig. Fantastic, great to know. And now I inserted a 16 gigabyte card into this Zoom um, and it worked. I recorded a good, I don't know, minute for this video and then suddenly it said uh, card was full. That didn't make sense since the card was empty. And now it doesn't even read the smaller card either. So I guess I'm just gonna go back to Guitar Center and return this thing as well. I guess we're just gonna have to bear with a, a little bit lower quality audio just for today. I'm so sorry, I tried my best today, guys, but at some point I just, I, my job is to make videos, not to go around and find audio equipment. <laughs> but welcome back to a brand new episode of WTRD, which stands for, wow, that's really dumb, like the scavenger hunt I was on earlier today. But in today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at some anti-maskers. I don't know, there's so many new videos of these that are going viral every single day and they're brand new. And I guess, hey, these videos just don't get old. So brace yourself, your head may explode from secondhand embarrassment today. The stupidity is honestly almost entertaining. I'm here because I'm sick and tired of your second rules. All right, say hi. We don't like to, I, do you think I want to wear Yes, I do. Yes, I, I do, do not want to wear You are she, I have to wear just like the rest of them. Why don't you people you educate yourselves? You need to- How am I doing? Out. My critic you? You're really close to Are me. you afraid? You I, should run away. I don't like But you have you your are. super mask on. I'm trying to protect you. <laughs> I don't need protection from you. Oh, you just touched me. I oh, really wish no, you Oh, no, I touched you. Here, I, I'm going to get COVID. I gotta go. No, you're probably going to give it to me. <laughs> are you going to leave? Look at oh. you. Are you going to leave the shame. store? Are you going to leave the store? Are you going to leave the store? Are you very going to leave the store? And aggressive to another you customer. Know? Would you please leave? Oh, I'm aggressive? Would you I please think, leave? Okay. Maybe. No. The thing I wanted to say, leave? which you wouldn't let me say, you all oh, see my face. Right? Pop. When you, oh, when I, if I ever come back here again, and this thing is proven to be a hoax, I want an apology from each and every one of you. See. Yeah, Educate it's, yourself. It's with somebody you know is sick, and then you listen. Nobody is sick. Okay. Go for it. Educate yourself. Please leave. Go online. Please leave and now. read and learn. Yeah. You all win. You all win. Wow, that was really dumb. And this is her leaving the store. But in all seriousness though, imagine being this disgusting of a human being. People are genuinely afraid of this virus. And some people genuinely have underlying conditions, which means if they get this virus, it could be fatal. And this woman's just here like, you know what? I'm just gonna spread the word of my insane Facebook group in the middle of a Michaels or whatever. And you know what, while I'm at it, I'm just gonna make fun of people who are doing the best they can to keep their communities safe and their businesses running. It, it just does not make sense at all. I mean, if she isn't careful, Darwinism might catch up to her. You never know. And this isn't just a regular Karen. This is a Karen, but spelt with a Q. A Q and on Karen? 
Yeah, oh, certainly. <laughs> and apparently, she actually gave her side of the story on her Facebook group here. So let's see what her side of the story is. Okay, apparently, it's not a Michaels. It was a Fabric Land. So got bullied out of Fabric Land, Calgary today for not wearing a mask. Told them I had a medical exemption. Managers and customers all surrounded me and hounded me to get out of the store. Cried all the way home, still crying, still refused to wear a mask. I've given that store hundreds of dollars over the years. I recognize every one of the managers who bullied me and I have always treated them with great respect. I told them I will be back for an apology from each of them when this pandemic is proven to be a hoax. Oh, and there was a Karen there too who made sure who got her phone out to video my humiliation. Well, she probably wasn't a Karen then. Because Karens are usually on the other end, like you, idiot. <laughs> I'm, sp I'm speechless from this. Poor J believes she was getting bullied from this. She was the victim here, guys. Wasn't she the one acting like a bully? She was like, oh, oh, are you going to get sick? Bullied. Like, I like the part that this is the person who was bullying the employees of this store for simply just following what their higher ups tell them to do to keep the store open. <laughs> Enforcing masks is the only way stores like that can legally stay open. So it's better to keep these stores open by complying with some rules than having them all shut down. Yeah, I don't think people understand that it's not really the choice of the stores. A lot of times it has to do with like the jurisdiction they're in or... Exactly. And she's the one pulling the victim card here. Yeah. Really? Some people are just seriously delusional. But if you thought that was bad, I I'm so sorry to inform you. It's all downhill from here. Alley attendees say they shouldn't ever wear masks if they have any medical issues or mental health concerns or if they feel they simply can't breathe. When George Floyd was saying, I can't breathe, and then he... And now we're wearing a mask and we say, I can't breathe, but we're being forced to wear it anyway. I am speechless behind the stupidity of this comment. Wow, that's really dumb is an understatement of what we just saw. This is equally as dumb to that guy guy over in the guy guy. The guy guy? <laughs> that, that dude, that guy dude. Who? <laughs> Sorry, his name is Guys. Oh. <laughs> I was just like that guy guy. You know, the, the Scottsdale dude? Oh, yeah, Guy Phillips. Guy Phillips from Scottsdale who said this. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. Stop naming children Guy 2020. Yeah, every single time I see that video, it gets harder and harder to watch. So, hey, what a guy. Not a great guy. More of a clown. <laughs> Yeah, your, your name should be Clown Phillips. <laughs> <laughs> but all right, what's the next thing we're going to watch to make me lose even more faith in humanity? Take your mask off! Yeah, take it off! Take your mask off! We're not doing it! Take off your mask! Take it off! Take Yes, please, yes, please remove the one thing that's keeping our businesses open and our elders safe. Why do we need those, they say. Morons. Not to mention the world's economy. I mean, like, we are one massive outbreak again away from everything just collapsing, and then we're just gonna have another round of job losses, which is then gonna affect everyday people like the ones who are chanting through this Target store. They are literally shooting themselves in the foot by doing this, and they, they can't see it for some reason? <laughs> ah! I hate people in 2020. What is going on here? Do you want me? How you get a mask? I don't have a mask. I don't have a mask. I don't have a mask. moment when you can't get your Miller Lite because you're not wearing a mask. 
I don't feel sorry for you. If you so desperately want your Miller Lite, just put something around your face before you buy the Miller Lite. It takes two seconds. Just put something to cover your face while you're in the store and you can take that thing off as soon as you're by yourself in your car again. It's really not that hard. Meanwhile, in Indonesia, they're, they're doing this with anti-maskers. So, hey, all these people we've watched in today's video should be very happy that they're not in Indonesia. They're, they're rather in the US and Canada. Which one's in Canada? The, the Fabric Land woman. Oh, really? She's Canadian. Yes! That makes me so happy. No, we just had the dumber people from the US. The I people know. saying the worst of the worst stuff here. I know, but at least Ugh. at least there's one less person to make me feel embarrassed. <laughs> Sorry, Canada. Uh, as an American with any common sense, it's really hard to watch the news. Yeah. 2020 is one hell of a year. Those people don't represent us, please. <laughs> don't think that. <laughs> but anyway, guys, please let me know in the comments down below what you think of this. Do you think the US and Canada should have a similar punishment to what Indonesia is doing to these people or should it just stay as is? Let me know in the comments down below. But anyway, if you're new here, I welcome you to my channel. It'd be awesome if you subscribed. Normally I have a better mic than this. I tried to fix it today. Better luck next time. Hopefully in the next video, I'll have something like this and it'll actually be working and the audio will be way better than an iPhone X. So hey, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Like I'm so athletic, I've been up since six, making hits like tennis. I've been on fire, I just need my credit. Wanna go far, need to change my settings. Reaching for the stars on my feet, touch heaven. Haven't had first, bitch, I already want seconds.